because you shot yourself. Who did? You did. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I didn't. <laughs> Someone had too much lentil soup last night. Yeah, you. You? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> right, today I've got me Marshalltown trowel. A fucking load of shit. What? To be honest, the, the metal, like, I used the uh, old WHS trowel, it's like 30, 40 years old most likely, and uh, the metal just feels so much better quality than uh, than the Marshall Town. But this Marshall Town that I've bought is the nine inch narrow London pattern, or just the London pattern. And it's, um, it's a really nice shape, really, nice size like perfect size yeah mate yeah yeah uh, it's got a really nice shape and really nice size so um, I'm gonna give that a go today what we've got to do is we've got to get the flank up that we're on now because um, I think they're trying to get another gang here to take the plot next door on so obviously I want to get the brickwork up it's been loaded so is that so you can't see the other gang so I can't see the other gang. No, it, I've got. A, they, they've got a wall to build there as well, haven't they? Mm. Yeah. So I have to use. I've loaded my bricks out. They want to be able to load their plot out, so I have to oh. build that wall so they can load out the other side. Oh. So we're going to do that. That'll probably be done by ten. Um, and then one of the lads is going to be loading the lift up. Uh, plot three and floor three and four. The third lift I've done last week, they didn't see me build, and I've got to crack on with that. And that's about a day's work on that. Um, I looked at it again last night, it's only about a day's work, so. Uh, set you up for a time lapse, I think, this morning. Uh, if you're wondering why I'm building corners uh, with a profile, it's easier for me to. I'm working a lot closer to Amy, um, and that's why I've done it like that. But anyway, Harry's just got a full barrel back. I'm gonna chuck it in the back. The sun is rising. Got my new little Marshall Town for the day. See if I like it. Little nine incher. Mucks on the board, ready to go. Feels quite nice. The lift's quite high, actually. All right, Liam. Morning. Morning. YouTube famous now, mate. Hey, showing all your little girly mates, weren't you? Look at me, look, look at me. New trousers. <laughs> new trousers. Look, fucking hell, I ain't gonna stay new for long. Harry's going up on that lift to get it loaded for me while Liam's looking after me and Amy. Um, so yeah, let's get cracking on. Let's get cracking on. Every time we say goodbye They all see that it's a lie Cause we always give it one last try Yeah, you've watched me break a thousand times Now I'm all alone Cause you never show You say you will But then you don't That's how we go
You keep timing them wee wee's a bit fucking on, on time, didn't you? 10 mm. 2, oh, I really need a wee. Should I just go and put a cup of tea on? Should no, I just go? don't you fucking goes, lie. Oh, I'll just go put a cup of tea on. Uh, no. I need a wee, I'm busting. I was, I held it in I'm, from 30 I'm busting. Uh, I'll just go put a cup of tea on, alright? No. Come here, look, she's sitting here <laughs> munching away. <laughs> Fucking music blaring, loving life. <laughs> I'm up there slashing, Actually covering trying. her money for her. Get right? it right. I said I need a wee, but I'll wait till break. And you said, go on, just go, go stick the kettle on. I said, what? Off. I can go early. And you went, yeah, I'll stay here. You go stick the kettle on. No, so I didn't. Give me bullshit, you bastard. No, I didn't. You're, you're a liar. Fuck off. You're a liar. <laughs> you fucking, you just went. I'm off. I'm Who's off. Too fucking right. I've been working my ass off this morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> You're doing all right. Off the break. Took a little bit longer than what I thought. Uh, obviously, I'm having to show Amy quite a bit, but it's you know to be to be expected. You but know. you are cheeky because this morning you had the nice little straight bit, and you gave me the bit where there had to be a fucking hole in the wall. <laughs> No wonder it took longer. I didn't have a clue what I was doing. <laughs> well, to be honest, how I should have what I should have done was um, doubled the other corner up, which had nothing in it, and then I should have gone down the other end with all the three quarters and the all the fiddly bits in it, and just let her butt off of the easy bit, which is what I'm going to do on the other side. We're going to double up, so we ain't got too much of a pull in one go. We're going to double up the uh the full corner with no ga gas box or electric boxes in it uh we'll double that up and then that way uh when i set up down the other end i can come off the face of the house and then run down towards amy and then i'll have to put the uh i'll have to do all the fiddly bits with the gas and the electric yeah yeah sound better Sound better, huh? Yeah. She was a she was stressing right out, wasn't you? Yeah. And then and then you was happy when you got a nice easy little bit, wasn't you? <laughs> Change of mood, wasn't it? Change of mood. She went from to... <laughs> <laughs> didn't you? Which, you know I was just looking at you and you was just running in this nice little bit and there I was trying to cut halves of bricks, trying to work out how to get a half in. And I looked at you and you're just there with a lot like a fucking bastard. Sorry. Yeah, I mean, it's your second day using bricks. You've gone hard bit. I'll use the fucking easy bit. <laughs> fucking 15 yeah, years but, of experience. But at least you know, right? See, what most what most um, bosses do who take apprentices on, yeah? What they mainly do is put them on the easy bits all the time. Yeah? And it's good for the boss because, you know, they're running in the long straight flanks and bits with no cuts and bits with nothing in it. Um, but the tr trouble that is, the apprentice starts to think, oh, I'm fucking laying loads here and I'm only getting paid 60 pound a day, 80 pound a day. But then you stick them on a hard bit and they, they don't know the fucking arse from the head. <laughs> and you have to stop every five seconds to help them. Um, so if you are an apprentice out there and you're running in straight lines all day, just be appreciative that you are getting get a chance to be on the trail, because a lot don't get a chance. Uh, and just keep slapping them in. Just see it as 
see it as um, practice for making money when you go on your own. You know, there's no point in saying, oh, I think I'm worth a hundred pound a day. You know, if you're on 80 pound a day and you think, oh, I'm worth a bricklayer's money because I'm slapping loads of bricks in. If you think you're worth a bricklayer's money, then, you know, and you think you're worth more, then go elsewhere. Um, the chances are you're not. You just don't realize how easy your life's being made for you. And what would that be? Tell you how to build. <laughs> Good practice. Get your hammer. Uh, what's under that, look. Yeah, sometimes it, it does get in the way. Now what I'll do as well, because this is jointed up, this will be my new, and I know that I've got these nice and plumb, uh, the, these two courses, this one and this one, will be what I owe by this two, whereas everything else I was eyeing to the bottom. Now I'll buy from this point up and this point up. With a level? What do you mean? Stack all the bricks up, please, Liam. Sorry. Uh, your work's fine. I checked it out over it. Usually what we do is get a couple of scaffold boards when it starts getting a bit low. Put them through. Yeah. Let's get to that height. There's loads of scaffold boards somewhere over there. You can do. We'll stack them up again. It's up to you. As long as they're stacked up high, but they don't last for long. Now, I'll just stack. Mark on this board, please. Around the corner. <laughs>
line up. Let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. The fit. So, <laughs> that's a very empty. Yeah, I know. But if there are this empty, you're gonna have to just get a little bit like this until you get the hang of picking tips. When I do the next one, it usually fills Yeah, but not when it's that empty, it won't. They're laid pretty well to the line. They're not really, there's not really much I've got to do to change it. Just get your snots and put the line up, away you go again, yeah? What I like about the long side of Dory is you can't go past. Keeps it lovely and lovely and plump. well um, there's quite a few people I notice comment about oh you turn more with the pick and dip you've got to turn more times you've got more movement but think of it as you turn every time if you're laying a long bed yeah you turn and you pick the muck up you spread it you turn you pick the muck up you spread it you've turned three times now you've got to turn every time to pick a brick up as well so you're eliminating, so if you, if you turn, I don't know, three times to lay a bed for six bricks, then you've got to turn six times to lay them six bricks. That's nine times you've turned, yeah? So, but with brick and, pick and dip, to lay six bricks, you're turning six times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. 
life. Six. That's uh, six times I turned because I was picking the muck up and the brick up at the same time. Now, if I'm laying a long bed, which I can't really because I'm using a really small trowel, but let's just say, I don't know, I'm gonna lay a big bed I can with this small trowel. It, I've turned one time. Now I'm doing one move, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have to turn the muck a lot more because it has to be perfect to spread it. And you can see what I'm, there's so many moves. Now, I've done all that movement and I haven't laid a brick yet. Now, you're one, two, three. One, two, three, and you're turning as well. It takes a lot more time and a lot more skill to lay bricks this way. Now, it's good to learn this way, but when you've got long straight flanks like this, less effort, less wrist action, less movement. Isn't that right, Amy? Oh. <laughs> You don't fucking know, do you? You don't fucking care. You just gonna lay these bricks you're laying right. Perfect, watch. You stand this, you, you, if you want it for this way, you go like this, look, watch. Or don't. <laughs> I want to put it in because I know you're just going to put it in. <laughs> Shit. You want to, when you're pushing it down, right? When you're pushing it down, when you're pushing it down, if it starts to fold over onto the brick, that's you want to cut it off before it does that because that's when it stains it. Now, the sponge does take it all off, but it's good practice to pick up you want to push it down as it's folding out you don't want it to fold out and over onto the brick because i mean these bricks clean up easy with a sponge but look can you see all your smudges and that look where you're pushing can you have a little look at your bricks you've laid anyway <laughs> don't it's let <laughs> you just get out of the fucking way let me have a look I yeah it's literally just all minimal movement just to just to lay them Little, you're just, you're just wanting to edge back. The bottom's right, but your back, your front is just a little, just not even, you know, a lot of bricklayers wouldn't even care, but.
bit stiff in some places and it just needs a bit of That's turning in. Oh yeah, it ain't too bad. Yeah mate, yeah, just get on with all, uh, all the internal walls need reloading. Yeah, all the brick, whatever bricks need loading, need loading. What walls were there before? So, Back on there. Yeah, I mean, you, you've got uh, three courses left on these, so you need to even your stacks out again. Where, well, you'll have a stack there, and then a stack down the end, and then count how many long, you know, count how many long, three courses high, divided by how many stacks, and then get it all nice and reloaded again, ready to, for the second pass through. Yeah, I yeah. Because I'm recording. I'm just gonna get this last course on and we'll get the music on yeah. <laughs> You'll be using all new muscles that you haven't used before, that's why. Hog carrier is a hard craft job, but bricklayer is just as hard on the body, but just different areas. Need strong forearms, strong hands, strong grip, strong wrists, good strong back, lower back. Well, you will do. Are we in? Should be. I can bet be. Alright, let's have a little look through then. Uh, yes. People need to see your progression. I'll tell you what, Amy, they're not bad brick. You're not bad too bad, considering it's like your first day, second day. They're all nicely laid to the line. The only thing you're struggling with is, you know, filling the perp up a bit more. But there's nothing wrong with that. Apart, that's, that's, this one's a bit on the dodge, though. I've just noticed that it wasn't. It wasn't. No. Well, what, what, what happened? What happened to it then? When I laid this one. Uh, yeah. Knocked that one. So out this is why. Do you know? This is why I said start about four bricks back. Work towards the half because then you're pushing the half onto these, and these are set. Because you started about there, you're not going to push these back. But if you try and lay that and then level it and then try and put a brick up against it, yeah, yeah that, yeah. So that's why I said start four bricks back, yeah. That was just the first. Well, now you're not level. Clam. Let's have a look. All right. 
Yeah. Line up. Line up. Are they heavy ones, are they? No, they're a bit lighter. I think they're a bit wetness. Oh, were they? Line up, boy! Come on! Right. What are you doing? What does it fucking look like? <laughs> what are you eating? Morrison's fried chicken and chips. I thought you were vegan. Not today. <laughs> <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Not today. I thought you fast. Not today. I'm alright. It's just you. Oh, come and go to Morrison's. <laughs> come on, please. Please, I've worked really hard. No, I we didn't. deserve chicken and chips. <laughs> all right. I'm all right. Can't sit here and watch you eat chicken and chips without me having chicken and chips. <laughs> oh, um. Site manager rang up the. Oh, okay, you hold it now. No, no, you're all right. You want to you want it, yeah. Oh, my wrist hurts. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, rang up um, Jason, the um, contract manager. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> and uh, he, uh, he was like, please, can you send him up there? I need him up there. So we've got to go up there tomorrow. <laughs> so we're going finish to finish up where we are today. Right there. Some more. Uh, Harry's pretty much loaded the plot out, I think. Just got the cell cons left to do, but we'll see. Uh, <laughs> oh. Almost there. What's the time? It's a little bit late. You don't even want to know. <laughs> you don't even want to know. You'll fuck. I thought, you know, as Amy's having a two days off tomorrow, I'm gonna make her wake work late. And me and the boys will have an early day tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, only because I miss you, babe. <laughs> Come on, let me enjoy this day, eh? <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> I'm down your end now, ain't I? The holy end. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> down the fucking holy end now. You know, it's very good. Oh, was it? <laughs> Quick to pass the blame, ain't you? I'm teaching you well, I'm teaching you well. Oh, Amy's endless smudge galore. <laughs> <laughs> Amy! Yeah. Come clean your brickwork. <laughs> you saw, you, are you saw on the tools out here? No, she said clean your tools. Oh, clean my tools. Yeah. Alright. I'll clean my, I'll clean your brickwork, you clean my tools, yeah? Yeah. Oh, 
bad. Bad lads, considering. I'm going that halfway. I know, what's going on? We're fucked up here, aren't we? I blame Harry. It, Harry wanted to do another tub. I'll do it for the top. Ah? <laughs> yeah, all right. I'll leave you here if you're that desperate. <laughs> if you're that keen. Lovely old job, <laughs> Adam. <laughs> well, this afternoon, um, boys have got pretty much all the loading out done, so we all just jumped on the line. They had one half, I had the other. Uh, we was all dishing the muck out together. And uh, yeah, they didn't do a little bad, too bad of a job. Um, I think Harry was laying from about here. Uh, shut up, you! <laughs> uh, oh, don't want to show him that side. Fuck you know. Uh, <laughs> uh, this ain't too bad. Amy's is a bit on the ropey side. <laughs> Can I take a joke? Let's have a look. Fuck you, it's state of it, look. <laughs> Fuck you, do. Ah? Yeah, don't leave the wheelbarrows out, they'll be the first thing to go. The old, uh, the old groundwork is love a new wheelbarrow. <laughs> Few down with this little niner. <laughs> Looks tiny, doesn't it? So yeah, we got that side up to, what, well, how many courses? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 courses. Well, that side up 13. Uh, me and Amy got this side up. Well, Amy done, done a nice little job. This is her little section here, I think. She was getting to about, about here or something like that. I think she's done pretty good, personally. My tools in the in the van. Go on, Harry, get going, mate. Yeah, you got a bit of walking. Up. Is my tool bag in here? Is it, Amy? Where's the water? 